everyone. I'm going to showcase a couple of interesting points about Elon Musk and Nikhil Kamath's podcast. Happened a couple of weeks back. And let me showcase some more details here. So if you go back to the video, you can see uh, the total number of views as of now is 8.3 million. And you can see the total number of likes is 251k. And the total number of comments is 20,083. Right? So what I have done is I have used Python coding. I have used Python to extract the data from, for whatever the video I have shown, right? Elon Musk and Nikhil Kamas podcast. I extracted the data. Majority of the part I have covered, I captured like top 100 comments. And you can see based on the likes. So top 100 comments based on the like. And also I have calculated, captured the sentiment analysis for those comments. And interestingly, so if you can see, uh, for the first comment, you can see uh, you can see 38,000 likes, right? So this is... Uh, too extreme exceptional for this particular comment and i will show now you can see the uh, you know we want a podcast with kim jones right so let's go back to the youtube video and let me scroll down to the comment so this is the second comment is the pin comment but you can see this the, the second comment where you can see the number of likes is 38k so that's the same data i have captured in tableau by making use of python code got it so these are all the top top 100 comments i have captured and I created a bar chart on a high level, just want to showcase. But whenever you are going to mouse over, you can see the sentiment score. So there are like huge number of likes, but uh, I can see the sentiment score when you compare with the overall. Uh, for this particular uh, comment, we don't have uh, the highest sentiment score. I'll showcase that. I have created another visualization for uh, calculating the sentiment score. I mean, this is uh, in directly we have used Python code to capture the sentiment score. Basically, sentiment score measures the overall emotional uh, tone of audience or in comments on in general in YouTube video, okay? So YouTube basically calculate the sentiment score by analyzing each of the comments using some uh, natural language process. And uh, it will assign uh, some of the polarity between minus one to plus one. So basically you can see the range, uh, range of the sentiment score is like minus one to plus one. And uh, it will average overall score to understand the audience emotions, okay? But when you go back to the first, uh, I'm not sure how it calculates. There are like different models to calculate the sentiment score. But if you go back to the highest sentiment score, it is like 0 0.990. You can see when you mouse over on the comment section, there is a, it's a long description actually. So might be, I mean, there is a positive sentiment. There's a positive words. Whenever there are positive words, it will give you the better sentiment score. But you can see the long conversation rate. So there's a long comment uh, here. So probably uh, we need to go through in detail on the comment section to understand why exactly we got the highest sentiment score. Got it? So if you can see, this is also long uh, long comments, right? So maybe YouTube is considering the number of votes to calculate the sentiment score. I do feel like I'm just checking on a high level. But yeah, positive, there are like other keywords like uh, uh, the positive words and also the negative words it will capture. But uh, when it comes to like uh, for the first comment, you can see it captures the number of characters or number of uh, words. And also there are some mix with some of the positive keywords added in the comment section. So that's the reason you can see the highest sentiment score. Got it. So we have captured the highest comments. I mean, the comments with highest likes and the sentiment score by making use of Python. And also, as I said, right, so this is not manually captured. So I used Python code to capture the, the total number of views. You can see 8.39. So let me go back to the YouTube video. So the total number of views is 8.3 millions. And you can see the total number of likes is 251K and the total number of comments is 20,083. Here it is, 20,083. So while doing the video, no one has added a comment. So you can clearly uh, see the actual synchronizing of data, right? So this is what one of the interesting uh, data I have captured by making use of Python. And uh, one of the greatest interview I have, uh, I have seen uh, between Elon Musk and Nikhil Kamath. And uh, it's uh, for sure like credit goes to Nikhil uh, and his team. Like, And we learned a lot from Elon Musk podcast, like the energy and the artificial intelligence in the future uh, prospects. So yeah, thanks for watching and uh, please do subscribe uh, for my channel. Thank you all.